Good day, fellas. I hope you're ready for your daily dose of skill. Today we are going to play with all mighty Panther 88. Yes, you hear that right. Quick reminder, fellas, merch is still available for three days and some hours. Feel free to check it out. You will find the description down below. And after that, it is going to be closed. GG finito. Thank you very much for attention. And now let's have some fun with the Panther 88 if it is possible to have some fun. Okay, let's start from the good things. What this tank has to offer? DPM. You are waiting for more. There is nothing more, fellas. There is nothing more. Neither the gun handling is amazing, neither something else. You know, the DPM is pretty much the main selling point of this vehicle. That's it. Uh, this tank doesn't have absolutely anything else. So, in order to use the DPM, you need to get somewhere nearby... Uh, to the enemies right and just simply try to punish them for their mistakes and for their stupidity now the gun fellas trust me on this one when i say the gun is far away from being ideal because i truly think so and um, compared to the this tank compared to the panther 2 right tech 3 tank ooh, it's like a day and night fellas in other words the panther is just significantly better tank right that's what i'm saying uh, okay, both of them are Panthers. Panther 2 is better tank, okay? That's what I am trying to say and hip hip hooray. We finally said this properly. Excellent. Okay, I really do not like how this game looks like. Enemies have plenty of the forces over there, but by saying plenty I mean it. Like, full troll lot team is going towards this direction. We are going to lose this side. That being said, we are going to try to relocate from here before it's too late. That looks real rough and that looks pretty bad. But you know what? It is alright. At least on the positive note, fellas, we have a good DPM, right? Yes, 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 the score is 1 to 6. I'm aware of that, fellas. Not the first and not the last rodeo, that is for sure. Uh, but things like this are happening once in a while and there is nothing what we can change about this. Two minutes into the game, half of our team is dead already. Um, and obviously it doesn't look very, very simple. It doesn't look easy and it looks like we will need to work very, very hard in order to save our score. But you know what? We are going to be fine and we are going to survive this uh, or are we this is the question i want to take this position over there and now the real trades will start i hope that i am going to meet some tanks who doesn't have the best dpm so we can now trade them you know this is my hope this is my dream and this is what i'm looking for but we'll see time will show everything lt432 should arrive somewhere around this area i guess and if he won't arrive here, we are going to have a good farming party towards this, I assume. Beautiful shot. Hopefully we won't get punished for this. Yes, we are not punished. Excellent. Very, very good. How about this Shrek? How are you doing this fine day? Beautiful. Very, very nice. Our Sue is trying to run for his life at the moment, and I believe that makes sense. And in the same time, we have support from his side. I have no doubts whatsoever that he can stay slap this budget without bigger problems right at least that's what i am hoping for next what do we want to do at this point at this point we want to go a bit back and we want to use our dpm that's the most important thing in this situation fellas we want to get some use of our dpm right simple as this luckily double penetrator bounce that's good Oy, 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 fellas. Yeah, that was rough. That was a rough gangbang. I thought I am going to have tiny touch more support from the Sue, but hey, it is how it is. We cannot complain too much about this performance. Let's see the score and let's talk how the things went in this game. Okay, looks like we are back, fellas. Um, unfortunately, we lost the game and I was thinking what happened wrong over there. And you know what uh, was my thinking process? Whenever a situation goes like this, that half of your team is dead in the first two minutes, there is not much what you can do about this so sometimes you need to be humble sometimes you need to go um as first and you need to say yeah i i i 
there is nothing what I can change about this. We just can't win this game. And overall, that is okay. This is 3,000 combined and we can't complain about this. 2.1,000 damage, 900 assisting damage. We are, oh my bananas, we are first by experience, we are second by the damage, but look at this, how many zeros we have. Ooh, yeah, that is, that is painful and uh, that is kind of sad, don't you think so? Uh, also, if I'm not mistaken... If I'm not mistaken, this is maybe he he did not drown it on purpose. But if you see someone drowning, report them for unsportsman like conduct that can work. Meanwhile, fifty-eight thousand profits. That is okay, and we cannot complain about this. It's okay, fellas. First battle is like um, first pancake. It is always not the prettiest. Let's keep it up. I take my words back about the first game. It is the prettiest, okay? It is 100% the prettiest. Now we have a tier 10 matchmaking in uh, Empire's Border. This is going to be hard. And Panther 88 is a premium tank, right? In my humble opinion, this tank is a bit outdated, right? Let's let's say that straight. Um, yeah, sure, there will be some games whenever this tank will shine, whenever enemies will be clueless and whenever you can slap them left, right and center because you have good DPM and whatnot. I understand this and I'm very, very well aware of that. But what I want to say by saying this is uh, it's not really meta tank. It's not really worth a tank to consider buying or something. And the main reason why am I making a video with this tank is because I haven't played with this tank for like um, over two years on the YouTube, right? So I thought we need to refresh our knowledge about the tank. And I'm trying to uh, keep everything updated, right? I am trying to not uh, allow tanks uh, without video for like let's say three years or so although sometimes it happens and there is nothing what i can change about this right and also before buying one or another premium tank or the standard tank what i would recommend fellas i would recommend to check out the index page it is very very easy to use you can use the filters and whatnot over there and you can find the tanks easily and after that you can see the youtube videos to the right side corner as you could see here it is really easy it is really simple and you know um sometimes it happens that people are coming to my stream and they're saying skill i bought panther 88 I did not check the index page before, I thought the tank has whatever, a DPM or something else and it's GG, you know? And you cannot turn back the time uh, for, for that stuff and you are going to lose your money in a way, right? So keep this in mind, fellas. This is very, very important thing to highlight, right? I'm not doing this for myself, I am doing this for you and I hope that uh, uh, you will find it useful. I hope so. Meanwhile. What we need to do here, we need to keep them, we need to keep punishing those guys, right? This is actually amazing for us. Skill, what do you mean by saying this is amazing for us? The thing is, we are punishing enemies left, right and center, right? And this is absolutely glorious and this is very, very good. That's what we want to keep doing, right? In order to feel um, great and in order to get as much use as we physically and possibly can. I know that this guy is going to slap me like there is no tomorrow. I am very, very well aware of that. I know, fellas, I know. Uh, but this should be okay and this should be fine. Oh, my bananas, Tiger Mouse, Mr. Tiger Mouse. That was extremely quick damage, if you would ask me. That was extremely, extremely quick damage, fellas. I can see the Snowmad. Don't you worry about this. I can see him. Huh. What to do in this situation? I want to build a bit different angle towards this gentleman, for obvious reasons, right? I want to build a bit different angle. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Speaking of the German precision, you know, unfortunate. It's okay, we are trying to do our best. We are going to be all right. No panic whatsoever. We are feeling very, very good. Now, like I said before, what this tank has, this tank has DPM, right? 
and we will try to do our best in order to use it and in order to feel great about ourselves. 3.7 thousand damage with a Panther uh, fighting literally face in the face against the enemies. Come on, fellas. This is not the game to cry about and this is not the game to complain, you know? We did, we did a very, very, very good job. Obviously, it is still not victory. Uh, in fact, I would say this is more likely going to be a defeat because enemy team will cap the base. But we will try to do our best and we will try to perform to the best of our abilities, right? Good, someone is coming here. That is okay. Our heavy tanks are going for a base defense. That's good. I do not want to be the first guy who is going brr over there. There is simply no point whatsoever for us to do so. I'm trying to go for a blind shot. Unfortunately, I missed my blind, which is, which is fine. And once again, we are waiting until our guys will go brr. That's all we are waiting for. Okay, nice. Hmm. Too bad we are missing this shot. It's okay. Let it be. We are making pressure. <coughs> Once again, remember what is this tank strength. This tank strength is 100% fellas. This tank strength is 100% DPM, right? This is this tank strength. And oh boys, oh boys, we are going to use this DPM like there is no tomorrow. As you can see, I'm trying not to take uh, one for the team. I am trying to be extremely, extremely smart over there. And it definitely works. 4.5 thousand damage. That is completely fine, fellas. That is completely fine. Skill, do you see this type over there? Sure, I see him, but actually, do you? Because I do not anymore. Unfortunate fate for this gentleman. Now, all we need to do, we need to try to get a bit of the... Um, a bit of the meat of the artist. There is a big chance that they found the keyboards. I know it's unexpected and this is something what you would never see coming. But the thing is, object is quick and budget is even quicker, right? So what we need to do, we need to go simply for art hunting simulator in this situation. And that is completely okay. We rigged brother in arms. That is absolutely amazing. We can easily say for this gentleman, thank you for that and now let's see will we craft a good angle for enemy jeffs uh high explosives 44 millimeters eh, i mean i kind of could penetrate them but this is going to be relatively hard it's okay let's do that let's slap mikola and let's slap fox wolf how about that, fellas? How about that? You know what would be an interesting thing if we are if we would see them running away, yeah, and this is exactly what is happening. Now this object will definitely turn for us and probably he will slap us to death. That would be kind of sad, but it is how it is. Not much what I can change about that. Obviously, I mean, this is this is so typical. Not a big surprise. I knew um, what I am risking for and never thank for brother in arms before you rigged brother in arms. This is a lesson for me. Also, the budget is moving towards this direction. Nevertheless, pretty damn good game and I'm super happy about this. Let's see the score. Like I said, fellas, first game has no match to the other games, right? Look at this beauty, fellas. Look at this beauty. <clears throat> we got ourselves solid 4.6 thousand damage, 3 kills, solid ace wanker, high caliber. This is this is very, very good performance and I am feeling super duper hyper turbo happy about this, truly. A high caliber, we are first by experience, we are first by the damage, we made 136,000 profits, although uh, 50,000 from those uh, profits are coming for completing the mission, but still, nevertheless, very, very good score. Like I said, this time can work sometimes whenever all stars are aligned and whenever enemies are thinking peasant with Pantera he is harmless and I'm oh really okay and last but not least round number three against the tier nines cliff yeah that doesn't look promising but you know what we are not going to give up we will try to do our best as usual fellas that's what we are going to do 
So the first things first, I would say our goal is to take the middle. That's what I am hoping for. Middle is the proper play. Um, sometimes you can try to risk it for the biscuit and to go like this, but not with a panther. I am just simply too slow for that. Um, I would meet the MX and MX would slap me like there is no tomorrow. So I would rather be smarter and I would rather play tiny touch safer, if you know what I mean. Unfortunately, bad preying from my side, uh, 1000 shell velocity wasn't enough for my brain, and that is completely fine. We are, we are chilling and we are having a great time. Okay, what is, what is the goal? Goal in this situation will be to slap the Tiger 2 who is crossing through the middle of the field. This is always very much appreciated. And now we are going to take a look into the type and into the other guys who are trying to cross like this, right? Well, I can't say that they are 100% trying to cross. They are trying to peek sideways, right? That's the most important thing. The worst part of all of this is that they have big, bigger and better alpha damage than I do. What that means, that means the trades are going to be uh, definitely not in our favor, right? So that is a bad stuff. But we are going to be alright and we are going to survive. Meanwhile, there is E50 going through the open field. We want to punish E50 and ay 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 ay. What an unlucky timing for us to peek like this. That is okay. We are fine. And why did I set unlucky timing? Because those mother truckers peaked sideways at the time, so I took one for the team. That is okay. You know what I'm thinking? I am actually thinking about going up here. I do not really think that enemies would have anyone who could spot us. So if we are going to go on top of the hill, we are going to control significantly more of the map, right? So I would say this is just simply better idea for us. Oh yes, beautiful. This is exactly what we are looking for, fellas. This is exactly what we need. We are very, very well aware of that light tank, and I know I can take one in the ass, which I do not want to do, but it is how it is, and we are fine. I paid the tax for going on top of the hill. That is okay. Now, how to dig this ELC even 90? This is the question, fellas. This guy is going to be a big problem for us, and the question is how we can slap the living crap out of this mother trucker. The worst part of all of this is that Trash 103 is sitting over there, which is kind of sad thing. <laughs> I do not know how we can do this properly. Okay, our Udes thought he is going to punish him. That is okay. How about the Scorpion? Do we have a chance to punish this gentleman just like so? Well, we have a chance, but what's from that? We had our chance, fellas, but what's from that? I bounced the shot. Like I said before, the tank isn't the most accurate tank in the world of tanks. And I just simply cannot complain about this. I just simply can't, right? This is, this is obvious and sometimes uh, games will go this way. Now, what I would love to see is that our Arta would slap the living crap out of this light tank because eventually this mother trucker, he will think about going up. But Arta has no intention of slapping him, which is fair enough. That's to be expected. I know I am spotted all the time. I'm aware of that, but you know what? Oh, hello there. How are you doing? Beautiful. At least 200 damage to this side. Fellas, I want to say that straight in the face, this game won't be the best game in the world of tanks, okay? That is for sure. If we would finish with a 2000 damage, I would feel relatively happy about this and I would say, hey, look at this, at least we have done something here, right? This is what I am thinking and this is how the things are looking like from my point of view. Beautiful, we slapped the scorpion for once, that is very, very nice. Can we do the same thing for double penetrator? This is the question. Boom. No. This tank isn't a sniper. It is a DPM tank, right? 
you cannot expect to hit every and each shot with this vehicle because it doesn't it just simply doesn't work this way fellas it just simply doesn't work this way three tanks to go i would love to slap this trash 103 that would be absolutely glorious but i have a feeling that trash 103 is already in the in the scrap yard so there is nothing to say for us and there is nothing um, to do so let it be accept our responsibility and let's be happy with 1000 this is as much as we are going to get meanwhile elc is dead and uh, uh, there is no time left for arta to live um, in this game either so how this game went fellas it was quite painful one and maybe going on top of the hill was a mistake from my side but i am accepting this and i am going to finish everything with a style while flipping panther upside down and finishing everything like a bloody um, fidget spinner how about that that was beautiful i know fellas uh not so beautiful score but uh very very nice ending uh, we are uh, we are the flips goes yeah far away from being uh, this tank is far away from being very easy to play with and to be consistent with games like this will happen and then we need to be humble and we need to say thank you so all and all 1.4 thousand damage and three kills this is okay this is all we can get third by experience somewhere like eight by the damage and we have eight thousand profits for a premium tank that is low all and all where the performance goes i would not say it it was a bad session right 2.7 thousand damage 300 assisting damage so we pushed this tank up to 3000 combined um would i recommend to buy this tank absolutely not never ever in my life unless the tank would get some kind of buff anyways thank you very much for watching i hope you had a great time remember to check out the merch we have th less than three days left and thank you very much for your time and see you very very soon skills out for today peace